Hey there, Sagittarius. Welcome to your reading for the week of May 16th. Everybody's had a very interesting um, reading this week, and you, you are definitely kind of among those people. So you have the Eight of Hearts to kick it off. Uh, very good card. Eight of Hearts is um, definitely a card of socializing in a lot of ways. So a lot of you could be, you know, getting very social, going to a lot of events, going to parties and things like that this week, or just meeting up with friends in a lot of ways, which is nice. Um, I think people need to do that more probably. Um, it's also a very good card for working on anything you want to improve on, in your life. Anything. Uh, it doesn't matter what. Um, but with an eight, it's like the more you put into it, the more you're going to get out. Eights are very specific in that. that the, uh, the more you do to improve a situation, the more, again, the more you're going to get from it um, with this card. So I always tell people like work extra hard under an eight because again it's gonna return just return a lot faster to you. Next you have the five of clubs, so definitely um watch your health this week in a lot of ways. Make sure you're taking care of yourself. This is a card of like improving your health as well. But it can also be a card of a blessing in disguise. So if something happens this week like that doesn't look so great, or maybe you feel a little bit negative about um you know, or some, some some sort of situation doesn't work out, it's really a blessing in disguise. Or you could even be finding out this week that um, something that didn't work out in the past was a blessing in disguise. Again, this is like one of those things where you're like, wow, oh, great, I'm glad that didn't happen. Um, this is also a great card to, like, start new things under, like, even, like, hobbies and things like that. Especially, again, I would say for the past life, eight years, our lives have been pretty boring for the most part. Like, starting new things hasn't worked out. Um doing new things, trying new things, any of that, it pro probably hasn't worked out how you wanted it to. So now it's like time to get new things going. So again, even starting hobbies, doing new fun things, um, trying new things, being more adventurous, taking more risks, all those things are things you should do under a five of clubs. Next, you have the Ace of Spades. Ace of Spades is, uh, on one hand, uh, a card that's about uh, transformation, rebirth, and, and doing new things. It's kind of like the Death card in the Tarot. It's also kind of like the Ace of Swords. I, I, again, people always ask me, like, the cards, uh, do you match up their meanings with the, you know, with the Tarot cards? I don't, but some people do. And you can. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, but uh, this week I am getting that type of energy, that type of like charging forward, really kind of like pushing through something, really making something happen like aggressively. A lot of you could be doing that this week. Um, and this card also can represent you um, like coming, overcoming some sort of obstacle, you creating a solution to a problem, and you being the one that does it. Uh, so again, it could be a problem at work or in your relationship or whatever, and you could come up with a really nice solution this week with this card. Next, you have the Nine of Clubs. Nine of Clubs is a very good card. Um, it, it's all about improvements, things improving, business success, money success, more success coming to you. It can even be a card of, uh, it's a card, it can be a card of recognition where you get recognized for something well done that you did at work or, you know, somewhere else. Um, you know, this is like a really good energy. I, I would, I would say work really hard this week, especially with the eight, the eight and the nine. Um, you, you know, it's like the harder you work under this, the better a chance you have to stand out and be recognized. This is a card of achievement as well. So you could be achieving something new or something that you've been working towards this week. And it can also be the compl a card of completion. Um, it can be a card of like you completing something that you've started like a while ago or trying have been trying to complete. So a lot of you could be making those completions this week. And finally, you have the Jack of Hearts. So a lot of you could potentially have like an admirer at work, somebody who's interested in you um, standing out. But again, this is also a card of needing to have fun, which is a message that definitely comes up, especially with the Eight of Hearts. You know, a lot of you could be needing to have more fun this week, go out, meet people, be more social. You have the Five of Clubs, the Nine of Clubs. Both of those cards can represent needing to talk to people, be more social, and things like that. So again, I would say there's like a strong emphasis on needing to have fun this week and do something fun. So thank you for watching, um, and enjoy your week.